Normally, I don't say throw the baby out with bathwater, but in this case, like, throw the baby out. <laughs> all right, are we gonna sit here all night? Are we gonna go talk to some people? I know, the other week I went to a roller derby as a paying patron, so we should really get out and meet some new people. Yeah. Oh my God, hey guys. I'm so glad I found you. But what is this? Perks of being a wallflower? Let's get out there and mingle. My God. What? Why does your hair look like that? Oh, the beehive. That is what we call, my friends, peacocking. No offense, guys, but I just became the focal point of this room. I'm just, I need, why? Okay, so as I was watching the movie last night, by the way, we as a society really need to revisit some of those tropes. And I mean, you can just draw the line from A to B. Hey, dude, I don't want to make you feel unconfident, but you look ridiculous. By the way, you're not the only one here tonight peacocking. Look over there. Sick fucking joke, unpin your hive. <laughs> Over my dead body. Okay, look, I don't know where you got the idea for this do, and if you say you I were inspired, inspired by Beyonce's, Beyonce's loyal beehive fan base to purchase, purchase extensions and do a beehive for this single night. night. So help me God. Look, your hive isn't even pinned that well. I think we can hardly call this a competition. Why don't you stick to your side of the bar, I'll stick to mine. We'll see who holds it down. Fine. You ready to take a ride in the hive? Yeah, you look insane. You, on the other hand, I'd love to buy your nightcap. 